When a person's diagnosed with lung cancer, they commonly want to know how long are they going to live, and they'll often ask their doctor that question. And some doctors are somewhat reluctant to answer that question, but others will give an answer. It is important to remember that you, when you think about any answer that's given, that doctors don't have a crystal ball, and they're only giving an educated guess about how long they think that individual patient might live. Sometimes they do have information about the average survival for a group of patients like the one who's asked the question. And a term that you often hear used is the median survival. Now the median survival is the time that half or 50% of the patients will live for. So for example, this is a graph of a group of patients who've all had the same type of lung cancer at the same stage and been treated with high dose radiation therapy and you can see that 50% of the patients are living for two years. But it does mean that half of the patients are going to live for a shorter period of time, but half are actually going to live for a longer period of time. For example, if you look at the far end of the graph, there are a number of patients out here, not many, but a small number who are living for 10 years. So, you know, you get told you're dying. And they, to begin with, I've been pretty lucky, really. They told me I had six to eight months, two years ago, nearly. So I've done pretty well. Um, but I think I tricked my body there because I was so run down that I started to eat properly and stuff like that and stopped smoking that tricked my body into thinking, oh, she's healthy. And then it sort of caught up with itself now, whereas, uh, you know, things aren't going too well for me now. But originally they gave me four months to live and here it is, 14 months. So I, I feel I've been blessed that time. It was a time of such high anxiety, especially with lung cancer because by the time I informed myself about the um, survival rates, which was quite early on in the piece, one did feel the odds were stacked against us a bit. So David never lost a positive outlook. I found it more difficult. Um, and it was almost more difficult watching him, especially when he was in so much pain with the radiotherapy. I, would have, I think I would have swapped places. It was very hard to watch.